Next time, try this, painting. How do people prepare and paint the black parts for their bike, whether it's cases, ignition covers, hubs, parts like that? A lot of guys will tell you, and this is the greatest rage lately, have them vapor blasted. Well, that's all fine and well, but what if a guy doesn't have a vapor blaster? And what if he doesn't want to mail them to somebody who has a vapor blaster and pay for that? Bead blasting works just as well, but maybe you don't have one. And again, you may not want to lay out the money to have somebody do that. Paint stripper is still the best way to get your painted parts clean. Get some paint stripper from a local hardware store. Aircraft remover is really the best stuff, but it's very, very caustic. If you can get some aircraft stripper, it's great. Strip those parts, get them down to bare aluminum. That's really where a good paint job begins. Get that part down to bare aluminum or bare magnesium, whatever you may be painting. After you get it all stripped off, you can hit it with some Scotch-Brite or with some steel wool and get them nice and clean, just like you see those hubs there in the picture. As far as paint goes, I would recommend VHT chassis and roll bar paint. It comes in a high heat satin black. You'll get results just like that. That's all you really need to do is put the time in to strip it and prepare your parts. And then you can use a quality aerosol paint right out of the can. And you can turn your parts from this into really nice stuff like this. And that's all it takes. It's all about patience, preparation, and prime. And then you're going to get some good results on your paint jobs. So while vapor blasting may be great and people will tell you about bead blasting, you might want to do it at home. It'll be a little more economical for you. And you get bragging rights to say that you did it yourself. 